of August. And I'm getting ready to head out to um, lunch with one of my coworkers. We're going to have um, a little lunch session really quick. So I just want to get on here and vlog and show you guys really quickly just an outfit of the day. So I am still wearing that curly unit um, that you guys seen me do a review on. I do have it in a bun. You guys, honestly, I'm so obsessed with this wig. I've been getting so many compliments on this wig. Um, people have really been thinking it's my real hair and it's really versatile for it to be a half wig. Honestly, you can't tell. Um, but I just have it up in a bun and then I just have on this scarf. You guys seen me wear this a million times, but I just kind of try to tie it in a bow. And then I'm wearing this top. It's kind of like a blush pink color, which I'm obsessed with. Um, I got this from Rue 21. And then just I have on some gray leggings. And I got these also from Rue 21. I'm going to wear probably my silver little, um, sandals with it and potentially a jean jacket i don't know i'll bring it with me but i'm not sure you know it's, it's summertime but you know me i still wear like whatever i want to wear in the summertime but yeah that's all i'm doing i just wanted to show you guys really quickly um my outfit of the day but also i want to show you guys oh, i finally found a comforter for my um apartment well you guys know this is what it looks like it's by cynthia rowley i got this from um, my job i got it from marshall's but yeah i just thought it was pretty cute i wish it didn't have the black in it because i think it kind of throws it off a little bit but i like this little color scheme i was wanting to do white and gray and then i have like a pop of color so i'm going to do my pop of color be mint green so yeah i'm really excited so this is um the first thing that i got and then you guys know i per i got this d a long time ago and it's like obviously it's not going to really match with this color scheme um but i'm going to i think i'm going to spray paint that like silver i think that would be so cute so i think i'm going to spray paint it silver because i'm going to probably do like silver accessories with this like silver and gray and mint green obviously but yeah i just wanted to show you guys that nothing major just waiting for her to come and get me and yeah hey guys i just want to get on here really quickly and show you guys what my hair looks like um, I will here because you guys know I've pretty much been not wearing it out since I took the braids out. Um, but you guys know I was experiencing a lot of, like, it was really br brittle and really, really weak. Um, since then, though, I think it's getting back pretty strong. I've been moisturizing it really well. So this is what it looks like coming down from the two braids that I've had in. But, yeah, as you can see, I mean, I definitely did get thinner and things by the braids that I had in. And it's a little bit dry on the ends right now. I'm about to actually deep condition it do an overnight deep condition but yeah this is basically what it looks like um it's still pretty it's going pretty strong um but yeah this is just wanted to show you guys because a, a few people um did inquire about what my hair actually looks like um being so i haven't been wearing it out but this is basically how it looks um yeah so right now i'm just actually about to sit here and edit i'm off of work for the next two days so i have a lot of freaking look at this pimple you guys trying to come in but i have a lot of youtube work that i want to get caught up on and a lot of things that i want to get done so that's basically what i'm about to do is catch up on some editing and that's pretty much it i'm sitting here trying to debate exactly what i want to do for my birthday you guys know my birthday is on the 28th um, so I'm trying to plan everything out because I have a lot of stuff basically coming up. I'm about to move in, then I start classes, and it's going to be my birthday. Then um, Bae's coming to visit me, and then my best friend is coming um, right after Bailey. So it's going to be a lot going on in the next few weeks that I have to prepare myself for. So right now I'm trying to think about what I want to do for my hair. Um, I definitely want to do, I'm going to definitely have bundles, but I'm right now considering do I want to make a wig with the closure or do I want to get a sewing? Um, I'm kind of considering getting a sewing, you guys. I know um, just because um, I want something that's a little bit more permanent. I love my wigs and I love that I'm able to take off my wigs and wear my real hair the next day if that's what I want to do. And sewings are a little bit more permanent. But I kind of also like the idea that it's a little bit more permanent so I don't have to always take it off and on. So I'm kind of torn. The only thing about getting a sewing that's making me say no is the fact that I will, I don't really want to have leave out because I feel like it's supposed to be a protective style. So with the wig, obviously I would do a closure. I'm just a little nervous because I've never made a wig with a closure before. I've only ever made you part wigs. Um, so I'm a little nervous and this is my birthday here so I don't really want to just be experimenting. Um, so yeah, I have to find a good closure. Like I'm not good at any of that stuff so I'm like I'm kind of considering getting a sewing I'm just trying to weigh all my options here because I've never had a sewing before so I don't really know what to expect um so yeah I'm just still considering exactly what I want to do um as far as my hair 
um, I'm 50-50 right now, um, so yeah, that's basically it, you guys, I just wanted to show you guys what my hair looks like, so I'll just see you guys in a little bit. Good morning, guys, today is Monday, and I believe it's the 15th, yeah, today is Monday the 15th, and it's like 7.20 in the morning, I'm up super early, I have to be to work at 9.30, and you know right, right now I have to be back to work so um, I had to be up super duper early and yeah I'm just up and I'm ready and I figured I would go on because I have so much time but yep this is move-in week you guys know I'm moving on Thursday the 18th um, to my campus apartment and I'm so excited you guys but I still have so much stuff to do within the next week I've already kind of came to the conclusion that I'm not going to have absolutely everything that I need on move-in day which is fine um, I'm actually probably going to do, like, some more shopping that I need to do on Friday. So, yeah, um, basically, like, that's um, the plan right now. So, I showed you guys the comforter that I have. Um, I went to Dollar Tree over the weekend and got a few cleaning supplies. I'm not sure if you guys would be interested in seeing that. Um, but, I guess I'll just show you guys anyways um, what I got. And, yeah, so... Taking guys along for the process. So the first thing I got is this basic um, deodorizing to toilet bowl cleaner for the toilet. And then I got this, which I was so happy to get, and I didn't know that they had. But they have comment and spray form, you guys. Did you know that they have comment and spray form? I love how this smells. But I was like, okay, I don't know if I'm gonna wanna. So yep, they have. Comment and spray foam, which I love, and then I got some Fabulosa, which I love as well. I love cleaning products, you guys. And then I got this little Lysol um, automatic toilet bowl cleaner thing. And then I got some tissue, some sponges, and some air freshener. So pretty much it I mean, for now. I figured, you know, I don't want to overdo it because I'm going to probably be gradually getting stuff as I move in. But yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. Um, so yeah, Thursday is a big day. And yeah, um, I'm going to bring you guys along the way, um, you know, as much as I possibly can. And yeah, that's basically it, you guys. So just wanted to get on here and check in and tell you guys how everything's going. And yeah, so I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, so I'm at Walmart right now. Looking for some stuff for my looking for some stuff for my apartment. Um, I was supposed to make a list, but I didn't make a list. I'm just kind of walking around. I kind of made a mental list of all the things that I needed here, but it's just difficult because you okay, guys, this is the color originally that I wanted for my comforter, like, but. The comforter, the color that's in my comforter is actually a mint green, so I'm hoping that I'm matching it pretty well. But yeah, so I just need like a few more things. I definitely have to get a shower curtain and then some more decorative stuff. I mean, I need everything. Like, I still have to get a nice set of pots and pans. But my aunt um, was telling me to look and see if I found like a cute thing of like pots and pans, like a cute little pot and pan set. So. But I don't have any of that stuff, but for the first few weeks anyways, I'm probably not going to be cooking. I'm going to try though, because I don't want to be eating a whole bunch out. This one for $30. What is that? My 18 set. I think I was going for $20. Nine stick. Nine stick. Um, that's what the one we see. Comes with four pans, a Dutch oven with the lid. Yeah, that's actually a good one for some nineteen ninety nine. Hmm. But yeah. So I just thought I would bring you guys along with me and show you guys some of the stuff that I'm getting. Um, I'm probably going to stop this vlog. I don't know how I'm going to break the vlog up yet. One's probably going to be like dorm shopping and the other one's going to be actual moving day. <sighs> or whatnot. They changed my room in at the last minute. Um, which, I mean, I'm kind of annoyed about. Um, she seems like she's nice though, but... I had already been communicating with the person I thought I was going to be rooming with, so it's kind of weird I haven't really talked to this girl that much. So, yeah. 
Anyways, you guys, I need to focus so I'll get back on the vlog when I find something that I actually want to get. Alright guys, I found the throw blanket, which I like. I think that's the color of the mint green that's in my room, so I actually like that. Let's see what's over here. <sighs> Bathroom rugs. I don't really want a noodle rug though, honestly. I'm doing my bathroom like silver. Oh, this is cute. What is this? This is super cute. I have one of these in my room, but it's like an ugly tan color, but it goes in the closet. So I mean, I guess it doesn't have to be this color, but this is so cute, but that's like the color, the accent color. I don't need bed risers or anything like that or a garment rack. Oh, here's some more pots and pans. This one's $14.99. I need to get a blender. I'm gonna start doing some juicing. Oh my gosh, I so forgot to tell you guys, but I'm so upset with myself because I dropped, I went in the gas station today without my case on because when I'm in my mom's car, I can't put my phone to the aqua court with my case on it, so I always take it off. I took it in the freaking bathroom, I mean, I back in the gas station and dropped it and I completely shattered the bottom of my screen. So I'm so devastated and so hurt. My birthday's in a while and I just cannot have an ugly phone. So right now it's so bad to have tape on it because I don't want the glass to cut my fingers and it kind of did. You guys, I'm getting so freaking distracted, but I can't believe I forgot to tell you guys. I think it's some towels, but um, for my bathroom, I want it to see, this is pretty too, but I don't know what I would use it for. It's only 96 cents. So I feel like I can find something to put in that. So I'm gonna just grab one. It's 96 cents, but yeah. Um, I feel like I want to do my bathroom white and silver. So I still have a lot of things to get. Like, I don't know what shower curtain I have. It's not one I really love. And the ones I do like are so overpriced. Like, is it normal to pay $30 for a shower curtain? I don't know. I mean, I guess I'm moving out for the first time, so I don't really know what the, you know, typical price of free anything is. But I felt like that was a bit, a bit much. But, um, yeah, let me get back to focusing, guys, because... <sighs> But I like that nobody's here because I can vlog and feel like, I mean, I feel like people are staring at me, but I'm like more inclined to just be like, whatever, I don't care. Bath towels. I don't know what color, like since I'm doing silver, obviously I don't have silver towels, so I'd either have to get like gray or white. If I'm doing white and silver, maybe I could, then I don't know. I don't want to do anything. I don't want it to be too white either. Oh my gosh, rugs are kind of expensive. That's a pretty color. I don't know y'all. But yeah, update on this curly wig. Yeah, this is by far my my favorite wig and it was fifteen dollars, like the cheapest one that I've bought so far. But it was such a great investment. I definitely really purchased this. It has saved my life so freaking much. But yeah, that's all I'm doing guys. It's just finishing getting my stuff. So I'm probably not gonna vlog anymore in here. I'm just gonna vlog once I get home and show you guys everything that I got. Um because I need to focus and get out of here because I gotta go to one more store and run home before I pick up my mom. So yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. I'll see you guys next time. You guys, my card got filled so quick. Hope I didn't spend too much money, but I think I pretty much got everything that I wanted. So I'll show you everything once I get home. Okay, guys, that was such a successful trip in Walmart. I'm so excited now to like put everything together. I think it's gonna be super duper cute. Um, everybody was like, oh my God, that your room's gonna be so cute. So I think I got the right color and hopefully that will bring everything out that I needed to bring out. So now I'm just about to go run to Dollar Tree really quickly. I'm going to just see if they have anything um, that I want to get right now that I haven't already got because I will be moving this stuff by myself. I need to kind of be a little bit more mindful of that and I'll be getting a million types of different things. But um, yeah, guys, I'm excited. And yeah, so now I'm about to go to the Dollar Tree. So I will maybe vlog in there. Maybe, not. maybe I'll vlog when I get home. But yeah, I just want to let you know I had a successful trip in Walmart. Yeah, hey so today is Wednesday, so next day. I'm back at Walmart because I forgot a few things. I need to get some. I needed to get some black hair dye because um, I needed to dye my hair before I get my hair done for my birthday. Back to black, so no more of this peekaboo color that I had, um, just so that it looks better. And I don't want to do this for a long time. I think I'm going to film it for you guys, um, but then I'll try to get like some hooks to hang up my calendar. But now that I'm thinking about it, I don't even know how I'm going to do that because I didn't look at the back, the back to see which one to get. I don't know, like, see, like, I don't know if it will fit onto this or how far, like, how big the hook needs to be. I thought about getting thumbtacks because I feel like that might be a safe bet. But maybe I should just wait until I know for sure, which is annoying because I wanted to 
stop having to make so many trips to Walmart, even though I know I'm going to end up having to come tomorrow once I get in there and figure out, start figuring out what it, what it is that I don't have. These are like, like, I don't know, like soap pads, like the little things. I don't know, you guys, what to get. I don't know what the best option is. So I think I'm just going to wait on these. I'm just going to get the hair dye. And I think I'm going to just wait because I don't know exactly what I need. So I need to sit down and make another list of everything I need to get. But I need to be kind of inside of there to see first what I need first still. So, yeah. I just want to get out here. Let's go.